Hello everyone, today we are here with another USRP episode. Uh, this is our edited down stream. Uh, that's why the quality is a little bit bad, but I try my best to fix it. But anyway, I hope you guys do enjoy this uh, video. Alright, let's go. My god, it's actually difficult to stare. Yeah, this, that was a little bit ridiculous, it's feel uh, <clears throat> I openly smoke weed. Openly. God, I can see nothing. <laughs> Holy moly. Let's see. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I don't see it all day. <laughs> oh, he's, he's going for me. I saw him. Ah, are they pulling me over? Hello, my friend. Hey, uh, I got a quick question for you. Yes. Um, what is that? A uh, special lettuce. Special lettuce, huh? Yes. Okay. Um, would that special lettuce be defined as perhaps marijuana? Is that what mm. special lettuce you're talking about? Maybe. Okay. Uh, Jimmy, if you driver, can you step out of the car for me? Uh, yes, of course, of course. Okay, maybe to the back. Yeah, you have your ID with me, buddy? Yes. Can I have it? Oh, yes, uh, here you go. It's gonna be Appreciate Dmitry it. Petrovsky. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Hang on for a second. Okay. Uh, so where are you heading tonight? Uh, grapeseed. Grapeseed? All right. What's your uh, business in grapeseed? I deliver any special letters. Special deliveries? Okay. <laughs> you know, uh, doesn't look very secure on your car there. That's a very secure, my friend. Mm, I don't see any straps or anything on it. I had strapped on my roof. Mind if I take a look? Yes, sir. Yes, you mind or yes, I can? Yes, you can. Okay. Just hang out right there, right? Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, whoa. <coughs> hey, man, you, you know it's a... Uh, Pretty badly secured on there. Oh, that is a very secured. Mm, no, not when I kind of wiggled it a bit. It kind of slid off your car a bit. It's very secured. Nah, you gotta check your check your straps again, man. Mm, okay. Go ahead and check him. Huh. <laughs> You see? Oh! Oh. See? Now you, now you got a mess to clean up. Uh, L Y W e. 833. God damn. Now I have to clean it up. 
Look what you're doing. What, what did you do? I was, I was checking the strap and it, it fell down. It's <coughs> very... Maybe it was not secured enough. Yeah, I told you it wasn't secured. Just be barely touching it moved it like an inch. Uh, uh, is that marijuana yours? Yes, I'm delivering it. Okay, you know you can't have more than half an ounce of State of San Andreas, right? Well, I thought I would also love to have this uh, pellets. No, like not even a little bit of that. <laughs> are, are you sure? Uh, yeah, I would say that's more than half an ounce. Oh. That's not good. Yeah, so at this point, I need you to do me a favor. Can you do, uh, t oh my gosh, I can't even talk right now. Do me a favor, turn around, put your hands behind your back. Uh, okay. Oh my god, it's really like it. Alright, man. There may or may not be more in the trunk. There may or may not be more in the trunk. Is, is yes. there anything in the vehicle that we need to know about other than the trunk? No. Okay. Okay, so it's Pedrowski, right? Yes. Okay, at this point, you have the right to remain silent, and then you say it can be used against you in the court of, court of law. Uh, you have the right to talk to a lawyer for advice before we ask any questions. You have the right to have a lawyer with you before questioning. Do you understand your rights? Yes. Okay, do you wish to talk to me at this time? Yes. Okay. Uh, where where did you get all of this marijuana? Uh, Route 68. Route 68, okay. Yes. Uh, do you have a more definitive location than that? Uh, I, I picked it up behind uh, at uh, the six at the big uh, mall there. Okay. Uh, do you know what postal code that is? Uh, 935. 935, okay. And who was it? Is it a, a man or woman you bought it from? Yes. Hey, uh, where, where did you say you got all this from? Uh, 935. 935? Yes. And do you remember who you got it from? Uh, yes, it's another friend of mine. Another friend of yours? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Well, you know yeah, this at, th at this time, man, yeah, yeah, you're looking at a lot of jail time. That's a lot of marijuana. Um, yeah, it's, it's a felony to have this much marijuana. Yeah, multiple. What I do want to ask you, though, um... And we want to we would want to work with you. I mean, if you want, if you're able to help to a, a an arrest of the of your supplier, I mean, it, it'll definitely go easier on you uh, when it goes to the judge. I mean, are you willing to cooperate? Yes, sure. Hello. Okay, yeah. If I, if, if hey, I hey. give you if I give you your cell phone, you know, are you willing to call that person and see if they're you know meet up with you to do another deal? Yeah, no, he, he, he's, he's, he's very difficult to get a uh, hold of because he has a burner phone. Okay. And if I if I were to give you a burner phone, would you be able to, to talk to him and maybe set up a deal? Yes, the only thing is I need I need uh, uh, his the, his burner phone numbers because he has a lot of numbers. Okay, and you don't have those? No. Okay, what what could we do to help you to get those numbers? It's very difficult to get those numbers because he does, doesn't just give out those numbers. Okay, well, I'll tell you what, I'm going to talk to my uh, my buddies over here. Uh, if you can think of a way to, to do that, I mean, I mean, you're going to go to jail for, you're going to prison for quite a long time. That's a lot of weed, so I'm going to step away for a few minutes. If you can think of a way to get that number to... To call him, you know, that's going to help you out in the future a little bit. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, bricks of cocaine in there. Hey, bud, do you happen to come with that number yet or no? No, no number, yeah. but I may know where he lives. Okay. Uh, where do you think he lives? 
Uh, Ron 952. 952, would he be there now or in the next, next you know, 10, 15 minutes? How you doing? Yes. 952, okay. Hold on one second. All right, so at this time, what we're going to do, I'm going to, we're going to release you. All right, okay. we're going to, we're going to be following you. We're having a few undercover um, officers that are going to be joining us. So what I what we need you to do is call your buddy. We're going to have you go over there. As soon as the deal is made, we're going to come in. And then uh, with your cooperation, uh, you're going to get a much lower sentence, okay? Okay. All right, so just hang out there for a minute. We'll get this set up, all right? All right. Thanks, bud. Uh. <laughs> all right, so what's going on? Is I, I called my friend. Okay. So he watched. He he's ready to sell at his house a big brick of weed. A big brick of weed is it just one brick or is it multiple bricks? I I don't know. I think he said only one big brick. Okay. Just go ahead and chill in front of this uh, trooper's vehicle. All right. Okay. All right, sir. Just go and follow me. Okay. Okay. Just at any any point, if you deviate from this plan. Uh, our deal's off the table, okay? Uh, okay. Alright, just go and follow us. Alright. Help? Oh, yeah, no, absolutely. Yeah, we're waiting on one oh. year old unit. He's gonna bring in a bear cat. Oh, and bear cat. We'll, we'll roll with him. Uh, the gentleman over here, Mr. Petrovsky, um, is gonna go ahead and set up the deal. As soon as the deal is done, uh, we'll go ahead and roll in. Okay, well, I'll suit up, I'll get a vest and all that. Am um, I just going to be in that, in the F-150, eh? Yeah, you'll be our eyes. And then as soon as we get the, as soon as you get the green light from Mr. Petrovsky, uh, we'll all roll in. How am I going to get the green light? What's the green light? What am I looking for? Um... Uh, Mr. Pedrosi, do you guys do you normally go inside the house or how does he normally do the deal? So what I can make him, uh, I can go inside the house. I can make him do the put uh, the weed, the brick of weed, into my truck of my car. Okay, so what we do as soon as you get in your car, just flicker your headlights, your high beams. So make sure you know your 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 point is where we're at. As soon as you get your high beams, we'll go ahead and uh, we'll roll in. So. Uh I'll be looking out for that, for his eye beams, and then I'll call it over the radio. Is that the plan? Yep. All right. That sounds good. What's the plan? Um, where are we? Where are we actually going? Because I need to know where I can sit uh, without nine, being nine five seen. Two. Nine five two. What's the plan? What's the? I have. I'm. Okay. So basically, here's. So we pulled over Mr. Petrovsky over here. He had a, a large amount of weed. He's willing to cooperate with us and giving us the supplier. Uh, we have to catch it obviously in the act. Um, Mr. Pedrosi is going to drive up there first. Um, 044 is going to go ahead and drive up to where he can see his headlights. As soon as the deal goes down, uh, Mr. Mr. Pedrosi is going to go ahead and hit his high beams. And at that point, um, 044 will give us a green light and we'll go roll in. Um, we do need a bearcat for this, I would suggest. That's what I heard over the radio. If you guys want to <laughs> set that up, I'm going to get a vest and stuff. Okay, yeah, I'll go. I'll grab the bearcat right now. Is that cool? Yep, that's fine. All right. I don't have uh, keys, nor do I know where they are. So, <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right, you're you're good to go, man. Okay. Observe from afar, and then wait for the signal from our. Uh... <laughs> Hello.
Go. It's dead. I can't reach this dispatch. Don't move. I got him. Two cannons in one go. Let's go. Yeah, he's probably gonna need medical for that informant. I'm good. He <laughs> shot at me, but I, sh I shot him in the. <laughs> One, two, get two guys in one go. <laughs> yeah, he, he started shooting at us after he came out of the building, so. I know he shot at me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Direct. Well. Fine, though. No shots. Yeah. Uh, by the way, I shot your guy. <laughs> What was that about, man? Uh, I, I killed you, guy. Uh... Where's where's the informant, man? Where's our informant? He's inside. He's I inside. shot him. I Sorry. shot him. In, he's inside a, a, a bag. Uh... He's inside a bag, okay. Yes. Uh, he, he says the, the informant's in the house somewhere in a bag. Okay, but we need to know exactly where that bag is so we can get medics in there. Where's the uh, bag, man? In the living room. In the living room? What color is yeah. the bag? Black. Black. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, county medics are here for this guy, so if we can go get that guy, we have air we'll have air med come in. All right. Yeah, county medics right. are here. Go ahead and with them. And... Yep. All right, guys. Yeah, go ahead and take him. Hello? Help! Oh, he shot he's me! Just, uh, Help. Oh, he's in there! Help! Oh, he shot me dead! So we can't... I, I, don't know, I don't know what we can... We can't go in there. You need to come out. Yeah, you gotta crawl out. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta crawl out of there, buddy. Saying that he's dead. What is that? You gotta go to the third floor. Uh, there we I'm go. Out. He shot me... He put me inside me, he put me inside a pig. Ah, <laughs> uh, we got medics on the way. Try, try, try and save your breath. Hold on, might be a time to find out what happened now. Okay. Maybe this, uh, fine officer give you one of his bracelets. No, thank you. I don't want any of the bracelets. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna come grab my car. You, you're alright with staying with him for a sec? Yeah, I got him. Right. <laughs> this yeah, guy wants his bracelets, anyways. It's pretty ugly. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd he shoot you, man? I oh, in my stomach. You got you in the stomach? Oh, okay. <coughs> so much blood. Just hang in there, alright? We got air. No, we got the. Medical helicopter in route. Oh, that's great. I have to still go to prison? Uh... No, not, not that I know of. Okay, good. Alright, man, can you see the helicopter? Yes, it's a very big helicopter. Okay. Yeah, they're here. They're here for you. They just gotta land. Time to land fast here. Yeah. <laughs> Just remain calm, alright? Okay. Is it a bunch of blood? Uh, I don't know if I should tell you or not. Is, uh, yeah. Oh, that means a lot of blood did. Possibly. That is a definite a yes. <laughs> you, you don't know that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a lot of blood. But I'm not gonna look. 
Uh, we got a gunshot wound here to the stomach. Uh, there's quite a bit of blood. Okay, you already got it packed and uh, wrapped? Yeah, I, I, I got it packed. I've been putting pressure on it. Okay. You want to help me slide this backboard under him and uh, help me get him into the back of the helicopter and we'll get him out of here? Yeah. Just need to slide it under him. All right. All right, just give us a countdown. All right. Three, two, one. Move. There you go. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll let you go first there. We want to just set him on this, uh, set him on this thing, and I'll jump across. I got him. All right, All right. There we go. Yep. I got him. <laughs> got, there All right, right, hold it. Let me jump over. Yep, we got him held. Oh, there we go. All right. Oh my god, this is awesome. <laughs> 